This is one thing that causes a lot of problem in marriage. Bias cultures. There are many cultures that believe women are slaves. And so when you marry a man who believes his culture more than the word of God, you are in trouble. The Bible said you have made the word of God of none effect by your tradition. So even tradition can weaken the potency of the word. When you are marrying a man, don't marry a man that believes his culture more than scriptures. Tomorrow he will wake up and say, no, 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 they don't do this. My people don't do. Who are your people? I thought we are all in Mount Zion. <laughs> we, are not all, we are not all in Mount Zion. No. Some people are still from Otupa. And, and <laughs> oh, in my place, when you want to get married, the elders will come. Carry Kolanot. Talk, talk, talk. They will release curses into the Kolanot. Cast pears into the Kolanot and drop it on the ground. And tell the woman to pick it. Now, the, the, the potency of that culture is that if you pick that kola nut and eat, even if your husband die, now, this is what the Bible teaches. In Romans chapter 7, from verse 2 to 3, the Bible says, if your husband, your husband dies, it said you are free from the law of marriage. But in the Otoba people's belief, as you eat that kola nut, if your husband die, you dare not think of having anything to do with another man. You will live like that. If you want to do it, you will return the bride price and they will labor you a harlot. And if you do it and you don't have stamina in the spirit, your first son will die. Argue it, you will see it. If you are not a man of the spirit to fight, you'll be sure. When, when I wanted to marry, I say, if I see Kola not, <laughs> if... <laughs> If you bring any cola nut here, I will shock you all. So, that part of the ceremony, nobody spoke about it. Because you can't try it. So, you want to get married, find out if the person is still, still belongs to his culture or if he belongs to the Bible. Because if you marry a man who is given to a biased culture or you marry a woman who is given to a biased culture, you are in trouble. <laughs> 